Hello everyone, welcome to today's class, and today is Pandora's Freezer. Let's move on to language focus. Ilbon. With rising temperatures, various animals will move farther north, as will humans. Okay, so we are going to look at just one word today. As. We're going to use as with an auxiliary verb such as do, have, be, or will, etc. to express that a statement is both is true for both things or people mentioned. Okay, let me make it sort of easier, easy for you. Let's have a look at the above example one more time. With rising temperatures, various animals will move farther north, as will humans. In this situation, 기온이 오르면서 다양한 동물들이 더 분석으로 이동할 것이다. And 인간은 또한 기온 상승으로 인해 북쪽으로 이동할 것입니다. So, because of rising temperatures, animals and humans will move farther north. So basically, we're using this as, as an and. Okay, now it does not mean that they will be doing it together at the same time, but it can mean that sometimes. It's just they have two things in common. So let's have a look at the next example. So I lived in Kyoto at that time, as did Mr. Kitazawa. Okay, so 나는 그 당시 교토에 살았었고 기타자와 시도 그곳에 살았다. So they have that in common. Let's say during 2005, I lived in Kyoto and Mr. Kitazawa also lived in Kyoto. We did not live together. 같이 안 살았는데 교토에 살았어요. We don't necessarily have to know each other either at that time. But we share living in Kyoto in common. So again, 나는 그 당시에 교토에 살았었고 uh, Mr. Kitazawa 도 그곳에 살았다. 교토에도 살았어요. It's very easy. It basically means and. So if I say I lived in Kyoto at that time, so did Mr. Kitazawa. That's the same meaning. <clears throat> the next example. Uh, I am going to work this Saturday, as is Francesca. So, 나는 이번 주 토요일에 출근할 거예요. Francesca도 출근할 거예요. 같은 회사 모르겠는데, 근데 저는 Francesca도 출근할 거예요. They're not, we don't know if it's together in this sentence. It could be, but it doesn't have to be. Okay. Let's move on to Ibon. Ibon. It's not hard to imagine a situation where scavengers such as wild dogs get infected after touching or trying to eat thawed out animals that died thousands of years ago. We are going to look at it's not hard to imagine. So use it's not hard to imagine or it's easy to imagine. This is also okay to use. Um, to express something is very possible. So in Korean, you could maybe translate it to 
뭐 어떤 상황, 뭐 사건 등등 가능성 너무 높아서 상상하는 것을 어렵지 않다. Okay, it's very possible. So, uh, let's have a look here. It's not hard to imagine. Don, 남자 이름, Don, not the money, <laughs> moving to a different company if he thinks he can make more money there. 그래서, uh, 돈이 거기서 더 많은 돈을 볼수 있다고 생각한다면, 돈이, the name, 남자 이름, 돈이 다른 회사로 이직하는 것을 상상하는 것은 어렵지 않다. 왜요? 왜냐면 그 다른 회사에서 돈더벌수 있으니까 뭐 당연하지. 다른 돈 남자 이름 돈 아, 다른 회사 갈 수도 있어요. Almost everyone would go to the other uh, a company if they were going to you know get more money so uh 상상 하는 것을 어렵지 않다 of course all right next one it's not hard to imagine a situation where another conflict breaks out between india and pakistan pakistan hago india mo kwangenen na no mo anjoyo koreaso mo Indo와 파키스탄 사이에도 다른 갈등이 발생하는 상황은 상상하기 어렵지 않다. There's always a bad conflict between India and Pakistan. Okay, now let's move on to the language focus quiz. 일본 I am a member of hmm, as is hmm. So remember, we're talking as. Like, I lived in Kyoto at that time, as did Mr. Kitazawa. So, 나는 그 당시 교토에 살았었고, 기치, 아, 기타자와 시도 그곳에 살았다. So, I am a member of, hmm, as is, hmm. So, Let's say something simple and fun. Uh, I am a member of the BTS of BTS Army. Should it be maybe the the BTS Army. Um, as is, I don't know my best friend. So, 저는 BTS Army 팬이에요. I'm a member of the fan club. 제 친구도 있어요. So is my best friend. As is my best friend. 이번 hmm, will hmm, next year as will hmm. uh, just keep it simple I will what 동사 필요하니까 let's say graduate 졸업하다 next year 내년 as will uh, let's say my sister 요 동생도 졸업할 거예요. So, 저는 내년 졸업할 거예요. 제 여동생도 졸업할 거예요. 그런 느낌입니다. Okay, 3번. It's not hard to imagine. So, like we said, 뭐 상상하는 것은 어렵지 않다. There's a very good possibility. Uh, it's not hard to imagine, let's say, Argentina winning. Oops, Tina winning. Uh, the next World Cup. Okay. Argentina ga tam World Cup eso umsu hanen go su sang sang hanen go sun orupti anta. Because they're such a good team. Uh, it's not hard to imagine a situation where the economy uh, doesn't improve. The economy is really bad at the moment. It does not look like it's getting better. 그래서 경기가 나아지지 않는 상황은 상상하기 어렵지 않다. Okay, now let's move on to the further discussion. 
일본. Do you think humanity will be able to stop global warming? Why or why not? So, 인류가 지구 온난화를 막을 수 있을 거라고 생각하세요? 왜요? 왜할수 없나요? Um, I hope so. We are living in a very uh, fast-moving uh, generation where technology is constantly evolving. So I hope that we are able to come up with some form of technology where we can start to use more cleaner, renewable energy. Um, there's been progress made over the past couple of years, and it does look promising, but it still does look like it's going to take a while. So, um, I just hope so, for my children's sake and my children's children, etc. However, it's hard to say, because we are uh, a race that does a lot of things that destroy the world. So, it's very hard to predict whether we can stop it or not. 이번, in addition to the permafrost melting, what other dangers will global warming pose? So, 영구 동토중이 녹는 것을 위해 지구 온난화는 어떤 다른 위험을 위험을 초래할 할 것인가? So, less food, less clean water, uh, coupled with the increase in prices with low income, will make it hard for everyone to live. Um, even these days, it's very difficult to, you know, buy a house, uh, pay for groceries for some people. So, global warming affects all... The, the, common, the economy, it affects um, what we eat. In the future, we may not be able to afford certain luxurious foods like steak, etc. Um, there's a lot of damages that global, global warming uh, produces. And it's a very scary time to think about it. But so much is happening at the moment in the world that, sadly, it's something that most people forget about. But we should pay more attention to it. Anyway, that wraps it up for today, and we'll see you on the next class. Permafrost. Permafrost. Microorganism. Microorganism. Worrisome. Worrisome. Hemisphere. Hemisphere. Thaw out. Thaw out. Scavenger. Scavenger.